We average one sexual thought every seven seconds. But sexual energy can be diverted. You're a superstar, new Tony Robbins. He suppresses people's natural desires, strike up the band. You're kind, you're funny, you're pretty damn amazing. About peace. He's not gay. Call you tomorrow. You're lucky that you date dudes. No, I'm not. I'm actually dead serious about that. If you ladies are ready, let's play a little basketball. Oh, really? Good shot to the nuts, and also dinged his melon. They're like little quail eggs. We found a brain tumor up against your pituitary gland. The pressure it's applied has blocked your normal male development. Basically, you've never gone through puberty. Got the penis of Stephen Hawking at the moment. I don't want to split hairs, but Stephen Hawking could actually get an erection. Breakfast is ready. So how's puberty at 30 going? He's got the Sunday Times rolled up in there. <laughs> we got one! You gotta help me. I'm horny, I'm moody, and I think I'm going nuts. Your puberty is happening at an accelerated speed. Pardon the interruption, but do you drive a silver Prius? I'm in session! My office! Now! We have 25 minutes. Hey, Pete. Wanna go over? Would you mind if I pop those on YouTube? I have to take a rain check. People put their lives aside in pursuit of their next orgasm. Orgasm. I don't know, you just seem different. Pete! You've been avoiding me. Come here. Uh-oh. Just realized I'm late and I gotta go. You'll never get it! You can act out, baby. I hate you I wish I was ever even born! I've been waiting 15 years for him to do that. Hi, Vale here. Now, if you are like me and you like a good laugh, here are the top 10 comedy movies of all time according to Rotten Tomatoes. Coming in at number 10 is Stanley Kubrick's Doctor Strangelove or How I Learned to Stop Worrying and Save the Bump from 1964. At number 9 is Disney's Up and number 8 is The Philadelphia Story starring Audrey Hepburn, James Stewart and Cary Grant. Toy Story 2 is at number 7 and its sequel, Toy Story 3, is at number 6. A Hard Day's Night starring The Beatles is at number 5, while Gene Kelly's Singing in the Rain is at number 4. Number 3 is Frank Capra's It Happened One Night and number 2 is Charlie Chaplin's Modern Times. And topping off the list at number 1 is, drumroll please, Betty Davis's All About Eve. Okay, so do you agree with this list? My favorite comedies are the Monty Python movies. What about you? Let me know in the comments below and remember to subscribe to our channel for all the latest trailer releases.